Be strong, but not rude. Be kind, but not weak. Be bold, but don't bully. Be humble, but not shy. And be confident, but not arrogant. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. The first thing I'm going to take is this Fix Glow Spray by Mylara Skincare, just to prep my skin a little bit. Now moving on to my favorite toner is Hada Lago Premium Whitening Lotion. I love this so much because it helps to minimize my pores as well as my fine lines. Now moving on to this Perfect Glow Serum by Mylara Skincare, just to add a little bit of hydration and glow. Next is I'm taking this Naturals Rice Brand and Soybean Eliminating Daily Cream. Moving on to my primer, I am taking this Master Prime Mattifying Primer by Maybelline. Okay, next I'm taking this MAC Prep and Prime in Peach Luster just to even up my dark circles or any dark areas that I have. Taking my Squishy Sponge by Oyas Charmila to blend that out perfectly. I love this Squishy Sponge, you guys. Now I'm taking my favorite, favorite foundation by Wicom. This one is Natural Skin Foundation in code NW20. This one is a little bit light compared to my skin tone, but I will make it work, you guys. So just blend it out with my squishy sponge. As you can see that this foundation really gives the natural effect with a little bit of glow. I love it. It doesn't feel really heavy on the skin. It's super lightweight and easy to blend. Next, I'm taking my concealer by, this one is Fit Me Concealer by Maybelline, Code Light, just to do a little bit of highlight and brighten up any areas that I am focusing on, as you can see, and blend that out too. Okay, next I'm taking this LA, LA Pro Concealer uh, in Coat Toast to do a little bit of contouring right on my cheekbone and the nose bridge as well as the cupid bow and a little bit on the lid. And I would definitely want to blend that out. Now I'm taking this Lip Attack Lipstick by Curtain in Code 301. I'm using this as a tint of blush or a base for the blush. I love it because it's super smooth and easy to blend with. As you can see, you just dab it like that and there you got it, a little bit of tint of blush. Okay, a little coffee won't hurt guys, I need this. Now I am setting my whole look with the loose powder by Kritzen and I'm going to do my brows off camera. You guys can uh, view any of my eyebrow tutorial. Now I'm taking this cream shadow. This one has no brand. I actually got this from Lash Bar years ago and I'm just going to dab it and blend it out like that. The eye look is pretty simple for this look guys. So I am just going to blend that out and I am just going to apply the same thing right under my lower lashes using any flat brush that you guys have. And I'm taking this uh, bronzing powder by Wicon in shade dark. I'm just going to take this blending brush and blend that out on my crease. This one works as a contour, like a lid contour. Doing the same thing for the lower lash line. Pretty simple. Taking my favorite brown eyeliner, this one is by Silky Girl, and I'm going to tight line this, and I am going to bring it a little bit on the outer corner, like that, just a little wing, and smash that out with a black shadow. Now I'm taking my um. Cool liner by Sephora. This one is 01 Light Beige. To do my waterline. This one I am just patting this Moon Dust Eyeshadow in Code Element 
to add on a little bit of glittery effect. Taking my lash prism to do my lashes for top and bottom lashes. I actually used a couple coats for this one. I'm not going to apply any false lashes for this look because we're going to go for bold lips. Taking my Wicon bronzing powder to add a little bit of shape and dimension to my whole face. Using the same product from my nose bridge. I'm taking this Citrina Loose Powder in Code Rosa. I love this color. It's just such a sweet, pretty pink. Very soft and easy to blend with. For as the highlight, I'm taking this cover of Axe in Coat Blossom, this uh, shimmery pink highlight on my highest point of the cheeks, in a corner, and as well the cupid bow. Moving on to the lipstick, I am using this Smoked Purple by Max Maddox. This one is super matte, so you want to prep your lips before that. Finishing off the whole look with this Fame Lip Gloss or Lip Cream. This one is in Code Drama Queen. It's a dark purple plummy color. I love this. So this whole look is done. I hope you guys like it and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you guys for watching. Bye!